All right, this is another review of Geometry Wars Touch for the iPad. This time I'm looking at Titans mode, which is exclusive to the iPad. So uh, this is going to be very short. I'm just going to kind of show you how it works. Uh, in this one, you're facing these large asteroids, and whenever you blow them up, they break up into smaller, faster asteroids, which then themselves break up into even smaller, even faster asteroids. And so it's just kind of a... Uh, you know, it's very simple, but it's a lot of fun, very addictive, just like the game in general. Um, what you're doing basically is just, you know, at the, on the one hand, it's a lot of, you know, the standard game of shooting, but there's also some strategy here in deciding, okay, which one am I going to blow up and kind of choosing your targets in order. The green squares, uh, whenever they break up, they turn into uh, really fast ones that don't necessarily chase you, though. They kind of fly around erratically, so they're... You know, I go for those, but not when there's a bunch of other stuff on the screen. These uh, semicircle ones, I try to use the bomb to destroy or something because they break up into really fast uh, hunter ones that I have a hard time avoiding. And as you play, um, more and more of them appear on the screen at once until it becomes pretty chaotic uh, and very, fairly difficult for a novice like me anyway. As you can see, the uh, bomb button still remains extremely annoying to try and hit. Right there in the middle of the screen, it's just, it's, you know, nine times out of ten, you just end up dying trying to press it. And that's it. Uh, that's my review of Titans Mode for, I, for Geometry Wars Touch for the iPad. Thank you for watching. The name's Carusetta. I'm the Triforce Getter, the all-time record setter. One bad mother just like Boba Fetta. You like what I do? Put it in a letter. Don't know who I am? Hey, you better go to youtube.com slash carousetta.